everyone. I'm Sophia. Sophia the First, the princess. My friend Doc McStuffins the doc is out today. But the clinic still has patients to see. So I'm going to be the nurse, the fill-in nurse for Doc McStuffins today. So I'm going to show you my new toy here. The Doc McStuffins <coughs> clinic. Our first patient who could it be? Well, let's see. Who is it feeling well today? Is anyone? Let's call our first patient out. Oh, hey. Well, well hey there, uh, Miss Sophia. Where's Doc? Well, Woody, Doc is out. Doc McStuffin is sick today herself. Isn't that funny? She could. She's sick and and had to lay out of work. Well, uh. You know, I, I don't know. I'm not feeling well today. You think maybe you could check me out, Sophia? Why, Woody, you sure I could. I'd love to check you out and give you a checkup. Here, come on and have a seat on my new little clinic. Well, just lay down then, why don't you? What's wrong with you? Well, I seem to have fallen off my horse and now I have a pain in my stomach. I guess you could say I have a, a tummy ache. A little tummy ache, huh? So can you help me out? Well, I sure. Let's see. First thing we're gonna do, we're gonna have a listen to Woody's tummy. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Woody, I hear a lot of rumbling going on in there. What have you been eating? Well, just the typical cowboy stuff. Pork and beans and bacon and stuff like that, you know. You know. Ah, oh, I see. Well, from the sound of things, your tummy is just a rumbling. So let's take this stethoscope off and then... Just, just have a look inside your nose. Hmm. Hmm, kids. What do you think I see inside of Woody's nose? Hmm. Let's look into his ears. Hmm. Very interesting. Does anybody have any idea what I see in his ears? Let's see what in the book the symptoms are here. Let's see what let's see what Doc McStephens would do if she was here. A tummy ache. She would say, Woody, what have you been eating? And he already told us what he's been eating, bacon and pork and beans and stuff like that. So we'll turn back to this page. There's tummy aches. You know, I, I still am not sure what it Woody's problem is. I think I might just call Doc at home, even though she isn't feeling well. I'm going to call her and, and ask her what's wrong. Hello, Doc. Doc, me stuff and how are you feeling? No, not well. Oh, okay. Well, I've got Woody here, and, and it seems he's got a bellyache. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, I did. It's rumbling like, like, a, like a washing machine. Uh-huh. Yes, he said he's been eating pork and beans and bacon and stuff like that. Cowboy stuff. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, we'll do. Feel better, Doc. Woody? Yeah? I just got off the phone with Doc, as you can hear, and she says she thinks you have... Gas! What? Well, gas? Well, I'll be if I got gas, and, uh, well, how could that be? I just don't understand. Well, what do you see here when you eat pork and beans and bacon and stuff like that? Your little belly over here just gets a, a rumbling and a tumbling, and, and you need to pass a little gas, and you'll feel all better. I promise. Well, Lord be, you know, I, if I'd have known that right there, I wouldn't even have come in here today. I, you know, I don't like to come up here and see the doctor with just a little gas, but 
All right, Doc. Well, I mean, Nurse Sophia, I, I appreciate you checking me out. No, and I reckon I'll go home and break a little wind. <laughs> All right. Have a good day.